most respect and look up to as a front man out there, either past or present? Um, my favourite band and front man is R.E.M. I think just everything that that band's done from when they started, there were 15 albums down the line. And live shows are amazing, so, you know, it's one of the, it's one of the best voices. <laughs> amazing front man, some of the best songs that I, that I was just talking about. Bass player. Yeah. That, that's how it looks a bit like Greg. Well. <laughs> yes. Mike yeah. Mills. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> so, they're for me, I'm all And guys, so not front men, respective instruments. Um, Who do you look up to? Probably bass players would be John Paul Jones from Zeppelin. He was awesome. And played a little bit of keyboard, didn't he? Multi talented. He was indeed. He's got with the college. He's the king of drummers. He can come off the drums and go and sing it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you get enough drum solos no, when you no, play no. live? No. We've gone past that stage. <laughs> <isn't> it? <laughs> you got one? Uh, oh, a little bit, yeah. yeah. A little bit, yeah. I go, uh, Just uh, one. He puts our name in. Yeah, I, know, I really milk it. On the drum. <laughs> <laughs> I just need one of those little woolly toys in them. I think you need a few more. Yeah. What can we expect from you guys in 2008? What's the plans? Uh, more touring. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. So in uh, March and April we've got our biggest kind of shows to date. And then uh, hopefully all the festivals sometime. Mm -hmm. International yeah. oh, what about Australia? I've got to ask. Um, we oh, would love to go to Australia. We've got, like, I've yeah. got a petition. We've got some fans in Australia. I did my first Australian interview with mm. some guy who had to stay up till midnight. To oh, to no, they should have to stay up till midnight. <coughs> oh, okay. I was yeah. going to say. And uh, because we, we've got nothing released outside of the UK, but we've uh, we, uh, this girl came over to see us, like followed us around for a bit, and she. This is a petition of around sort of three thousand people from Sydney. That's sort of, that's oh, right, I handed that to her. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'm from Australia. I'm from Australia. Well, there you go. You've got some roots. I've got an Australian passport. Well, there you go. I'll get you. Maybe I'd leave you at passport control. Um, what is the best or most memorable gig you've ever been to as a crowd member? It doesn't have to be the best, just the most memorable, for whatever reason. Mine was... Um, <laughs> <laughs> mine was <laughs> Brian Wilson at Glastonbury, a lot, lot, I think it made me last. It was, it was one of those, you know, it was really nasty weather day. Uh, but that day it was just getting sort of nicer and nicer, it didn't rain. I went right down the front, I was on the barrier, and then literally came on stage, the sun just came out for the first time in about a week. And he, you know, he's got an amazing band there. You know, it's just you know, some of the best songs I've ever written. Uh, for me, it, it was a proper like, throat bump in the Did throat. Did you cry? Yeah, I think it did. Stop talking about it. <laughs> 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 it, was, it was on. It was on. It was being filmed for the BBC, and I was right at the front. And I was so there's a million pieces in you crying. No, 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 I watched it back, and literally, it went to the crowd, and it sort of stopped there. Just for you, just right, yeah. I was like, ah, oh, good. good. <laughs> I wasn't crying. I was thinking about it. Sentimental. Guys, what was the most memorable gig? Uh, I think the Stone Roses. I saw them at Wembley Arena. It's Roy. Right. Right. And oh, that was yeah. an amazing show. The Manics were supporting as well. Yeah. Yeah. I saw James the like when they split up for the first time. <laughs> him, but that was pretty. Uh, that was a good one as well. Yeah. Yeah. I take you to <laughs> yeah. best places. That, that was and that was, that was, was, that yeah. was pretty good. That was pretty good. Though. I mean, they had everybody who'd ever been in the band over like twenty years or something that came out on stage for the final song. So, yeah, that was that was pretty good. Amazing. Well, good luck to bring out, guys. Thank I'm sure you. it's going to go down over a few people's best gigs ever. Yeah. And um, good luck with good luck with the release as well. Thank you. Hopefully, see you in Australia very soon. <laughs> And also one thing we do. <laughs> one thing we do is we get um, all bands to do like a self, a little self portrait in one minute. Cool. There's three of you, so you can either just sign it, draw a face, whatever, and we give it away on the side. Okay. You can draw the you can draw the character. Greg has to write that all. He's the only one who can write. I can't spell. He can only write joined up. <laughs> 